All right, guys, let me show you right here. As you guys can see, you know, as you guys can see, this thing is completely, you guys see, let me show you right there. Let me focus. This thing is not supposed to be like that. This is supposed to be completely flat against this. And you know, you guys see it, it's not doing, you see the gap right here, even when it got 40 pounds of torque and this thing is bending. And I'm gonna remove this and I'm gonna show you guys. I got the new ones and see how those work. All right guys, as you guys can see, I just getting this one out and uh, look how the washer uh, looks now. Hold on. It's completely deformed and that's not supposed to be like that. You know, according with my uh, shop. Uh, hold on, let's see it. All right, guys. This is the one from Nolo. Yeah, I'm gonna get it out right now. But look at this thing, man. Um, you know, actually this part is damaging the plate. And you know what? Let me go now and show you guys this. This deformation right here is damaging the plate. That's not right. Okay, you guys can see right here. Look at this area right here. Basically, is carrying the, the, the uh, I think uh, it's like a, well, I think this hole is a little bit too big. Uh, probably it was made like that in purpose in order to, you know, adjust as you guys can see. Uh, but that's okay as soon as you get a, a better quality washer. But you know, look at this. This is already uh, out of shape because the uh, washer went inside when you put the 40 pounds and it doesn't deform right away when you put the 40 pounds on the uh, on the uh, on the bolt but with the tiny movement you know it's getting deformed it's getting little by little tight and tight and tight actually when I remove this I don't think this got 40 pounds already probably was a loose uh, 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 torque now, uh, you know, I went to try to get this one, but uh, this one, I get this one in lows, that's not good. This one, I get it in lows, and, and it's the same thing. And this one, I get it from my friend. Uh, uh, I get this one from the, uh, from, my from my mechanic. And let's put this together and see uh, the difference. Um, but you guys can see let me just I gotta I, I, I gotta flat this thing in order to you to guys see the difference hold on let All me right get guys, well I got this is the one I got from uh, my uh, my friend and this is Nolos and let's see the difference uh, in these two well but you guys can notice the hole is smaller I gotta use the drill and make it a little bit bigger but I'm gonna show you guys the big difference now uh, I just remove also the uh, uh, this uh, washer right here. Uh, this is the old one. You guys can see the. Hold on, let me try to focus right there. Uh, the effect of this one is gonna be minimum. It's not gonna hold real good. Still got some minimum grab right there, but you know, comparison the new one. Look at this. Uh, now it's gonna be easy to remove uh, the the uh, lock uh, the washer. Uh, and uh, easy to remove it like I told you guys but uh, for install the new one this one right here is gonna require a little bit of effort and for that you're gonna use this 11 millimeters uh, socket you guys put it right here and with a you know uh, any branch or something or hammer just hit a little by little until the uh, uh, the washer is already inside and do it carefully uh, make, making sure you're not gonna damage the thread of the uh, uh, of the uh, bolt but as you guys can see I just uh, brush it and everything it looks very good looks basically like 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 new uh, let me uh, let me just uh, make the hole in this one I'm gonna show you guys how to do this and let's see how to, uh, this thing uh, looks like 
All right, guys, I just use my grip and I just put this guy right there. And I'm gonna make a hole with my bit and my drill. We just make the hole. All right, let's see. All right, perfect. You guys can see this one go all the way in with no problems. And uh, just a few uh, try it and make the hole a little bit bigger. And look at this, all this dust, <laughs> all this residues of the metal right over here. And we make this this one really really nice all right now I want you to guys hear something uh, you know uh, in thickness it looks almost the same now I don't know if you guys can see the difference uh, and this one looks beat up a lot a lot a lot a lot but uh, it looks almost the same right well now uh, when you got this in your hands, you can feel the difference. Now let's hear the the, the, the uh, uh, how this one sounds when I let it fall from this from this height. Again. Now this one. This one is definitely more solid than this one. According with my, uh, my, 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 my friend, the mechanic of the shop, he told me uh, uh, a washer is not supposed to bend like this one. It can have a little bit, but not like this one. You know, I, I, I flattened this one too many times, especially when it's new. Uh, basically, I installed this like uh, three, four months ago, something like that. Uh, something like that, I don't remember exactly, but uh, I didn't even use the track of road and uh, this thing now when I remove it uh, from from the track today, it doesn't have not even the minimum effort to be removed. It means it lose, uh, uh, it lose uh, the torque and that's not good. Like he said, it's supposed to be tight, especially when you're driving off road. Oh, just think about it, you guys losing this, this, this one or two of these guys uh, right on the uh, on the road and uh, forget about it depending where you guys are <laughs> and, and you know that's gonna be a messed up and you know now I got this one uh, with uh, the stuff I think it's supposed to have Nolo please update this I know you guys got a nice quality plate I love the plate but this hardware must to be uh, change it for this one so at least something like that is stronger you guys can get it I don't know where I get this one from the shop of my uh, uh, my mechanic and <clears throat> uh, you know this is a completely different uh, different uh, material completely something really really strong for heavy duty stuff but uh, like I told you guys this one sounds like a quarter this one sounds like a, something like a metal plate or something like that, real, real strong. You can feel the weight in your hands. I'm gonna try to see if I can, yeah, definitely. I'm gonna try to see if I can measure this, the weight. I'm gonna show you guys the different in weight. Uh, of course, it's a little bit bigger, yeah. It's a little bit bigger, yeah. And uh, it's, it's, it's a little bit thicker, not that much. But it's like my friend says, is the the uh, uh, the quality of the material, the metal, the grade of the metal. And um, they said in, in in the track industry, basically it's like a grade eight or something like that. Uh, we don't know exactly, but it's usually real real strong stuff. And let me put this on the track and let's see how it looks like now. And I'm gonna put the 40 pounds uh, torque on it and let's see how it looks. All right, guys, I just come back from my job and uh, as you guys can see, I just take out my torque and, uh, you know, 
just for those guys that uh, you guys thinking uh, oh uh, just in case how we know your torque is working well I got that one I got this other guy right here that is a bigger one and also I got another one right here that uh, let me show you guys with the other one right here this one <clears throat> uh and you know i can compare this one is basically to check out my uh, torques this one and the other one and to uh, see if this they are working right and uh, so far my torque is basically is, uh, not only brand new it's already tested with this one and with the other one and now like i told you guys i just came back from my work and probably you guys gonna hear the, the sound of my engine and oh, let me get in here and I got a tough day let me just make sure everything is okay let me show you guys this is the new uh, the new uh, washer right there and that's the replacement and this is the other one I just get like I told you guys from my uh, professional mechanic friend I got my toy right here well let me show you guys as you guys can see it's 40 pounds and uh, let me see how I go here try to record this and Remember, when you guys grabbing the torque, you guys gotta know where to grab it. Never from here like that, never do that. Never from here, always right over here. As you guys can see, it got, you know, basically the form of the hand. Just grab it right there and just keep going. I already tied it, but you guys will see it. Okay, make the sound. And as you guys can see, 40.06. 40 pounds, 06. Let's reconfirm this, reset this, set it to 40. And we're going back. Uh, okay. Okay, that's one, two, three. Okay, basically, that's it. 40.06. And I don't know if you guys can see the difference, but this thing is completely flat. This thing is completely flat. You don't see any deformation. All right, guys, as you guys can see, uh, uh, this is basically uh, uh, an addition that uh, before I finish the video, I wanna show you guys. As you guys can see, I did some marks on this bolt and as you guys can see it didn't move at all i got about uh, three three to four days of use and as you guys can see the plate is dirty and everything and uh, i've been using this uh, uh basically every day and uh it didn't get loose and also as you guys can see uh the uh, uh washer it's very solid it didn't lose the form and everything i think uh nolo uh you guys gotta do an upgrade in this one it's just matter of uh sense in order to keep the integrity of uh of the plate i'm not uh saying that you know uh the uh, uh kit you guys got uh, it's not needed, uh, but uh, you know, it would be better if you guys sell this with these kind of washers uh, in order to keep the integrity. The plate is so beautiful. I love this plate and the design and everything. And you know, I don't want to lose it just because of a washer messed up the uh, 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 the form and the uh, uh, way that uh, the uh, plate, uh, the skid plate is supposed to be just because a uh, defective washer that is not enough uh, uh, hard to hold the torque of the bolt can damage it uh, you know i don't want to lose my plate just for that and you know uh, this is a beautiful plate 
and Lolo, please just do an ad rate. Uh, you know, just uh, uh, thanks God I got it on time, and you know, uh, it still looks like everything is okay. And guys, you know, I recommend you guys also let me show you right here. Uh, make sure uh, you guys put some grease. Uh, I'm using something different. I'm gonna show you guys right now what is that. Maybe some of you guys don't like it, but you know what is the reason why I'm using this? Because this is washable. I can remove it if I want and the plate keep the same uh, uh, color and everything. And yeah, this is grease and it protects this from corrosion and everything because uh, sometimes you will see corrosion and after I using this everything looks real greasy and nice let me show you these guys and with that we're gonna finish this video okay guys as you guys can see it there you have it is right here the blaster surface shield and it's good for rust it protects real good it's greasy and uh, you know it lasts for uh, quite a long time and I like it guys check it if you want you guys can get this so far I only see this in Home Depot uh, I don't know if it's uh, in Amazon right now but you guys can get it in any Home Depot specifically the, Bla uh, the uh, Blaster brand you will see it in, in Amazon in, in different places but make sure it says uh, uh, the one is uh, like this one Surface Shield and you guys will see it right there that you guys can see this is the uh, chassis of the car and everything make sure it's this one you guys can pause the video and get it this is very very good it's greasy i'm not gonna lie to you guys this is greasy and kind of messed up some guys like it sometimes not but i prefer a, a protection on my car and make sure everything is gonna be okay for the years to come okay guys well this is the finish of the video thumbs up subscribe and see you guys in another just my review see you guys later